I could be one of those clocks. You know, with like the clocks where it's got the moving eyes and the moving tail at the same time. Tick, tock, tick, tock. I'd be a kitty cat clock. Brow. 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 Um, so I am sitting on the floor of the bathroom of a hotel in Nashville. Ooh, I'm in Nashville. I'm in Nashville. I'm in Nashville. Hmm. There's nothing to do and it's like 10 o'clock at night and I'm not tired. Uh-uh, I'm not tired. I was in Illinois yesterday, and now I'm in Nashville, and tomorrow we are going to keep on going to South Carolina to pick up my other cousins, Greg and Chris, and it's going to be fun. Not really, it's a long drive, <clears throat> so I'm kind of not ready for that. I'm, Staying awake all night. Well, I kind of want to stay awake all night and then just sleep the rest of the way there because I was awake. Um, I was awake on the way here from Illinois and it was a very long drive, but we were listening to the, the Hunger Games um, audiobook in the car and we made it to like chapter six or seven. And so that was okay because. The book is a lot different than the movie, and I never read the book, so now I get to listen to the book. And what better time to listen to the book than when you're traveling, you know? Because then you can listen to it. I'm sorry, I have problems. Okay, so, today's topics. I have two topics today to talk about. One is serious, one is kind of just for giggles. Um, my first topic, sorry, my paper is up here above the camera, so whenever I look up, it's right there. Um, yeah, my first topic is what I am planning on doing this summer. Well, it's already summer, and I'm already doing what I planned on doing, which was I planned on going to my cousin Francis's house and ow, that hurt. <laughs> um, planned on going to her house in Illinois and staying there for a little bit. I wasn't sure if I was going to stay just a week or if I was going to stay more than a week. Probably going to stay more than a week because I like it down here. It's very peaceful. I like the energy. Um, and so we are going to go get my cousins, Greg and Chris. They are like my sixth cousins. So Frances is like my fourth. And then her daughter is my fifth. And then her kids, which is my cousin Frances's grandkids, are my sixth cousins. Mm -hmm. And, um... I haven't seen them in a year. It's been a. It, it will be a year. Sometimes, sometime between next month and the month after. Um, I met them for the first time in uh, last year around this time because we had a family reunion in Massanutten, and well, Massanutten, Virginia, and <clears throat> um, I told my cousin that I come and spend some time with her this summer and so I did and when I get back I plan on possibly seeing where other places I can venture to during the summer um I kind of want to see what the chances are of me getting to go to California because I have a friend in Cali that has been waiting about three years to see me and we don't talk about it much because we know that it's probably not going to happen but I really want it to happen this summer probably won't happen so I'm sorry because you know who you are that's watching this you know who you are anywho 
Um, this summer, I also plan on doing a lot more modeling than before because I really want that to be taken off. Um, I'm also planning on, what else am I planning on doing this summer? Um, my music, my art, the regular stuff. I want to get it out there more. I want to make more cool videos for you guys because you guys deserve cool videos. You guys are really, you know, all of my friends, all of my peoples that watch these videos, I love you guys for watching these videos. I just wanted you to know that. It means a lot. Um, so yeah, Nia asked me what I was doing this summer. So there you go, Nia. I miss you, girl. I haven't seen you since high school. I misses you since the big northwest. Um, second topic. Um, this topic was requested by Bree, my friend dear, my dear friend, not friend dear, my dear friend Bree. Um, this topic is about boobs, boobies, um, boobs. Okay, she wanted me to explain boobs and their greatness to the world, why they are so amazing. Boobs are amazing for many things, in case you didn't know. Boobs are good for feeding children after they're born. Boobs are good for um, uh, pockets, you know, because you could put stuff in there and it makes it like a little pocket area. I guess that's only if you have a brawl on or if you have big enough boobs. Um, boobs are also pretty good at cushioning things like people's heads or little kittens or baby birdies. When you find baby birdies on the street and you're like, oh, I want to help you and make you better. You just cushion them in between your boobs and you're just like, oh, baby bird, it's okay. You're in between my boobs now. Um, Boobs are good for filling out shirts that are too big for you. I guess if they're too big for you, that means you don't have boobs. So I guess boobs aren't good for filling out shirts that are too big for you. Because they're too big for you. Anywho. Um, the water, I don't think it's the water. Me and my cousin were talking about this earlier. But I don't know if you can see, but I'm breaking out in all these little tiny bumps. And like, they're not hives and they're not pimples. I don't know what they are. They're just bumps, like really weird things on my arm. And I'm starting to get them on my face a little bit, in case you couldn't tell. I'm right there, right there, right there, right there. And I feel kind of ugly because of it, because I don't have my hoodie. Usually I'd wear my hoodie on if something was wrong with my arms, like they were breaking out. But I didn't bring a hoodie with me from this trip. Um, my buddy, or my buddy, <laughs> my hoodie is in um, Illinois right now. So, excuse me while I take a drink of my Coca Cola. Um, okay, so, shout out time, shout out. I got a, actually a few more shout outs than I normally do. Um, shout out to Amber Vivian. Amber, you like my statuses all the time. All the time. You like almost all of my statuses, but you never comment on any of my statuses, which make me kind of sad because I love you and I just want to know what you have to say. But you only like my statuses. But it's okay. Keep liking them because I'd rather you like them than not do anything with them at all. You know? Um, by the ways, I hope things are working out between you and your mom with that whole, like, what she said, you know, I really hope that you guys are a lot better now. Um, Tyler Gunn, I am the bacon lord, may all your bacon burn, just saying, yeah. Um, Raya Bear, my dear Raya love, um... I am going to do your hair when we get, well, when I get back, I promise. I really, really want to do your hair because 
I know how to do it, and I wanted to do my hair like that at one point in time, but I changed my mind because I found something else I wanted to do, so I never got to actually play with my hair and do it. Um, so, we're going to have fun when I get back, okay, chick? Yay! Um, also, that Nutella... Oh, my camera! <laughs> my bad. Oh, no! Stay. Okay. No! Oh, my gosh, it hates me! Ah. Uh. Okay, um, so anyway, that Nutella, I'm going to have to go to the store and buy some before I can do that Nutella thing for you, but that's a really good idea, and I really want to do it, so hopefully when I get back to Cincinnati, I'll be able to get Nutella and do that for you, because I really want to. Um, Mama Simmons, Amy! How does it feel to almost be a grandma? You're so old. Actually, you're pretty young for being old, you know that? I mean, you're you're pretty young. And Chris is pretty young to be being old now. Chris is getting old too, you know? You, you and him both are getting old. Chris is getting older than me. He's getting older than me now. That's crazy. Ugh. Um... And then Jacob, you are like my hippie buddy, man. We haven't talked in so long. And you just hit me up out of nowhere like, do you remember me? And now I am remembering you and we are talking out. We're talking. We are talking, texting it up about stuff like anime and nature and going off into the wild. And I can't have those conversations with just anybody. So I appreciate it. You're a really cool man. I hope you keep texting me because you've been keeping me company while I've been away on this journey. Yeah. Um. I just said um like really. I probably said um about 14 times. You know what you guys should do? You guys should watch this video and let me know how many times I said um by the end of this video. Because it's probably going to be over, over 40. Like, I have a really bad habit. I have a social habit, very bad social habit, at saying, um, all the time. And like, I say like, like, all the time. Um, like, all the, um, time, like, all the time. Um, see, I just did it again. What? Oh, um, <laughs> oh, okay. I'm going to stop this video now because it's like already past 12 minutes and I don't know if I'll be able to upload it now because it's past 12 minutes so hopefully I don't have to re-record it. Okay, I love you guys. Mwah!